outscored his opponents 33 14 this year and is making his 16th appearance in the postseason. Notre Dame will wait for the winner of the next first round match. <laughs> You know, it's been a lot of hard work by a lot of different people. I want to thank Justin Doherty and the administration, obviously. But to see our student athletes get rewarded for their hard work, and we're talking about a four-year project. I mean, these guys came in the door at the same time I did. And, uh, you know, let's not forget the kids that were here already that helped in this process as well, that are proud alumni today, and, and the alumni are, are proud across the country. Um, guys that either represented the university and had success here and won a national championship, but just this place is a long history and it's nice to be back. And I know uh, there's a lot of people in the community that just are, are, are so happy and that they're going to get to see us play another soccer game because we, we really play some good soccer. So we haven't done it since 1995, so making the tournament is just a big deal for us and we're excited to get going. Not only that, but you get the host with, with the 13 game home unbeaten streak. Um, in the country. Just tell me what that feeling was when that was announced. Uh, I mean, it's a great feeling to have our rivals, Milwaukee, come into our home field where we're undefeated. Um, it's huge for us. I mean, we have a big advantage at home, and uh, we're looking to protect our territory. So looking to have a good game versus Milwaukee and beat them at home. You know, it's just it all came together, you know, senior year, and I'm very proud of the guys, you know. Everybody put in a lot of hard work. We have a lot of seniors that never made it before. You know, a program that hasn't been there in 18 years, so you know we're all very proud and excited. For you, for you having three years actually, having yeah. sitting out last year and not coming back and doing this, but also being able to host at home, yeah, I know, match up, unbeaten streak, everything like that. Yeah, I know. We're definitely excited about that, and we've been undefeated at home all year, and we feel so confident that we're gonna go in and uh, and win on Thursday. That's for sure. That's that's all to our mind. You know, luckily with 13 wins and and some big wins we had over teams that are in the top 16 in the tournament. Uh, Marquette and, and Michigan State, I think the committee took that into consideration and that's why we're fortunate to be hosting at home and Milwaukee's a fantastic program. Uh, Chris Kelderman and his staff does a great job. It was a great game in Milwaukee and ended up as a 1-1 tie. So uh, Thursday night sets up for soccer people in the state of Wisconsin to just be an awesome, awesome night and congratulations to the other in-state team that made it Marquette, uh, who's a seeded team. So. You know, it's a great day for Wisconsin soccer, for the UW of Wisconsin, but also just Wisconsin soccer, the community.